Hey guys and welcome back to Starbound. Um, this is just a short thing. I don't know whether this is going to go in a different video or it'll be a video on its own, but I was just digging around on my planet and I'm, I'm in a lot better gear now. Um, I'm in a Knave's Helm, a Scavenger's Greaves and a Copper Chestplate. I'm actually working on getting a Scavenger's Chestplate. I just need a thousand pixels. I've got 883 so I'm very very close to making that. However, I've just stumbled upon while digging this, whatever this is, look at them, they're like knights, maybe they're like rogues or bandits or something, but it's like an underground dungeon of some kind, and I've never seen anything like this, so I'm definitely about to go down there and fight it, and I thought I might share the experience with you and actually record it. My pick's so nearly broke, it's really true, true crime. I'm not sure how we're going to go into this or whether we're going to get rocked or not. We are on like a level 1 or 2 starting planet, so it should be fine. I can handle level 4 things very, very easily, so I'm sure it'll be okay. I think. I hope. Yeah, they're obviously, they're aggressive, so here we go. Oh wow, okay. Um, I killed Bite Spike, guys. I'm sorry. So these are different like decorations you can get in your ship. Um, I am tempted to take these. How much space have I got? I've got a little bit of space. I'm going to take the hanging cage. And I'll take the thing that obviously holds the cage. Uh, I'm going to need to climb up there to get that. Can we reach? Yes, we can. So what is that? That's, it's a vine. Okay. And I guess I will take this big cage as well. Cool. Uh, I mean, I like styling my, um... Is that lava? I don't want to go in that. Uh, I like styling my actual ship. We all have done it now. Everyone in my group. Um, it's very fun. Oh, Jesus! Look at this! Right, um, I'm gonna need the bow. There we go. No big deal. Got a blunt poker. This is a shit weapon. Right, I should be fine to do that. It's just strange getting the jungle sounds. Oh, that's a very cool door. Look at that. Oh, the sound it makes. That's disgusting. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, swap to the sword. Ooh, unref unrefined wood. That's always useful. Let's have some more of that. Is that a dangerous floor? Yes, it is. This is very strange. Oh, I'm jumping on bones. Can you hear the crack? Oh, that's so great. Is that a prisoner? Are these people... Are these... Is this some sort of underground weird prison? Oh, I opened it. Look, I freed them. I pressed the button and it freed all the... The, the trap people. So I, like, unleashed them from the cages. Oh, and they're... They're aggressive as well. They think I'm keeping them prisoners as well. Well, whatever. I can just go collect lots of loot. That was really neat, wasn't it? Oh, a nice little system. It reminds me of Cube World. Ugh, stop it. Ow. Oh my, I just got f I just got wrecked. Oh, that's quite far left as well. I'm pretty sure I can remember where that is, so I'll just... Oh, this is my ship right now, by the way, in case you want to see it. It's like a scientist research thing. This is my bed, by the way. <laughs> the experiment table. That's great. All right, I'm gonna um, gonna put all the crap that I got from that in here and deal with that later when we're not in a video. Um, modern science door. I've got a monitor here. I've got a lot of things to spice up. I've got bombs here and a flare. All right, that should do. I've got a lot of stuff, which is good. But yeah, this is my planet. If you remember, I will have shown this in an episode. It's just um, a standard green planet. I way over level it now, but um, that dungeon, i got to check out that dungeon. Oh, actually, while we're here, I have a thousand uh, pixels now. Slightly more than that, so I can make the iron chest, so I'll do that while we're here. So I need a little bit more iron. I'll make this silver as well, but where's the iron? Iron, that's copper. There, it's up here, it's on my hotbar. Sometimes that happens, it's kind of lame. Six silver bars now. I need about 12 for a pickaxe. That's the goal. The next level of, of pickaxe. Mine's nearly broke now. That does concern me. I don't want to break it. But I can replace it very easily. Alright, so the uh, 
iron smelting away. We're just going to go back there in a minute. I've just got to replace the old uh, chest plate. Look at those abs and the, the, the fine body that is hollow. Okay, there we go. And we'll put that up there. And let's actually make this chest plate. Scavenger's breastplate. Oh, look at that. I look like a security guard now. That looks very cool. Alright, let's get back there. It's a little bit of a jog, a little bit of a trek. I'll show you the world though on the way. And if it gets a bit too far, I'll obviously just skip. Save you guys some time. I remember when these gave me trouble. It's just one hit city now. So if you want to know what I'm actually using, I'm using just the standard uh, iron two-hand sword that I've made out of iron. I'm using the, the scavenger's armor and a knave's helmet. Um, so it's like better than copper armor and stuff and iron weapon and stuff. This is a prison. Um, I'm not sure whether I showed that or not. No, I think that's. Just, I just found that. It had like robots in it. I dug down there at one point. Fuck you. But it's easy money killing them, so you should you should probably kill them. Got a lot of bandages as well, so I've got a lot of regen. I'm just surprised that I got one hit there. I guess I just got shot from like three different angles. I hope all the money that's um, down there after I freed the prisoners is still there. I want to collect it. You can get some useful and interesting weapons off the thing, the enemies in dungeons like that, but most of the time they're just not as good as the stuff you're using, I've found. There's another sciency building here. I stole some stuff from here. As you can see, the doors are missing. i got to make my uh, spaceship look pretty cool. I could do with improving my actual um, base down on this planet, but I think I'm going to leave this planet before long permanently, so I don't really... I don't think it's that necessary, you know? My home planet. It's like a strange earth, isn't it? I already nearly got 500 pixels again. Alright, so we should be there very soon. I believe I entered through a cave system similar to this one. If you don't know what these are, uh, you can actually knock them down and the fiber trees. Um, our fiber can be turned into fabric and fabric can be turned into bandages and bandages is your main source of regen and it is incredibly important to have bandages and when you find trees like this that are just made out of fiber you can get shit tons of fiber and make loads of bandages and there's all your regen well that's unfortunate I've got to bypass this, this is poison water I don't want to stand on that and loads of the fiber went down into it oh well you must die so that I can get the credits. Have been this way before. I remember the first few puddles I didn't block up like that. But um, we get a bit further on here. I've gone into all these cave systems looking now. I'm nearly, I got a lot of silver while I was there. But we'll notice that I've been this way before very shortly based on the um, bridges that I've made over the poison water of which I just stepped in. Great. So this is what it's like to be poisoned. It's kind of annoying. Alright, I think it's down here. Yeah, it is. Yeah, this is the one. Better not die again. Alright, I'm going to bandage you up. This time, we're going to take it nice and slow. Probably kill them with my bow this time. And we went over this, like, hot coal room of skeleton crunching and we're in alright let's uh... let's try and range this fella just missed one more a little bit higher got him alright I'm gonna have to build a bridge across this it's very easy to build bridges like this, so nice alright so yellow stimpack I think that's the glow in the dark one. Might be blue that. Ooh, whoa, whoa, that's the guy that killed me last time. Ow. Okay, uh, I'm gonna take this guillotine and um, I'm gonna go take that uh, broken like cage. I want that in there as well. 
I like just changing the theme of my spaceship. It's so nice. Because you see it a lot. You want to work on it. It's a shame all the loot seems to have gone from me releasing those prisoners because I died. Shit happens, man. I got him. Ow. Wow, he survived my shot. Come here, you. Ow. Stop it. Oh my god, I can't get him. He's going to kill me. No. No. Bandage. Fuck you. He was in, like, in this awkward spot where I couldn't hit him. Alright, let's keep going down. Carefully, carefully. What is this? Oh god, look at that guy. He's got a giant cleaver. Oh, I, I've found myself in a terrible situation once again on these goddamn stairs where I can't fight back. So we have to awkwardly go all the way up. Get him like that. Because they do a lot of damage, these guys, by the looks. Right, let's try and go back to the ground again. Try not to die. Again. Alright, we should be on full health there. Gotta keep my eye on that. Alright, we're down. Oh look, yeah, the vases. You can break them for uh, money. And there's a bed here that if I... W Actually, I think I'll take that. That's a nice bed. Look at that. Yeah, definitely taking that. It's very beautiful. Beautiful. What's this vase thing here? Can I smash it? No. So it's just scenery. I'll take it. I'll take it. Weird name. Look at that light. Yeah, we're definitely taking that. And I guess we'll take the desk as well. <laughs> Look at me just stealing everything. I want it for my things. And we'll take the chair as well in the second light. Cool. Alright, let's keep moving further left. There are some things that I didn't go down on the right that I'll check out before we leave and end. Look at this lava, man. I've never seen lava in this game before. So this is actually the, le the legit entrance, I think, to the place. Because I didn't enter this place in the most legit of ways. A little bit higher. Got him. That's the hunting bow I'm using, by the way. It's uh, essentially the iron bow. It's a door. 168 pixels. Not bad. I'll take it. Alright, let's go with this lava here. I'll take the, um, the light as well. I quite like that. The wall light. Ooh, is that something I can take as well? Guess not. Okay. Oh, whoa, we forgot. Forgot there's actually enemies here. Got him. Can bandage you up. I can release all these prisoners, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna deal with everything first because I got a bit overwhelmed last time I unlocked and unleashed the whole force here. That shoots fast, doesn't it? Got him. Ooh. Ooh, I quite like the combat in this game. Very tense. Getting a bit hungry now. Ooh. Got him. That was a lucky shot, wasn't it? Alright, uh, let's go up and break these. There we go. Let's take another light. What is that? It's just a glowing thing. I'm not interested. Alright, let's kill all these. Oh, I'd like to free them, but they just attack me. So let's have a look. Oh, right. So I, I have to actually unlock them via this... Uh, look at them, the weird race things. Uh, I have to unlock them via this button. So here we go. I wanted to be friends, but you didn't. You didn't want to be friends. So I'm just collecting your money. Oh shit, pressed uh, the wrong button there. Got it. Getting a lot. 336 for one kill. Jesus, look at my money. I got 2,000 gold. Jeez. Louise. Got up. Wow, 592 in one. What is this? Yeah, so apparently dungeons is the best way to get money. Bloody hell. There you go. It's a shame, you don't really find in these dungeons, like, 
any specific loot. You find a lot of money, but you don't feel like find chests or anything, which is a shame. Alright, so we're going to go to the right now, since we cleared this left section. And uh, go down those very big drops at the right where I actually entered. And see what's down there. Probably another prison segment or something. Come on, get up there. There we go. How are you enjoying Starbound now then, guys? Um, I'm absolutely loving it. I mean, if you've not got it, are you enjoying the videos that I do on it? Because I'll be doing a variety by now, at the time of recording this, I'm sure. Hopefully, I won't be spamming you like I did with Cube World. <laughs> uh, on the bones. A third time. And be able to go down one of these. So here we go. Here's one. Oh, it's down here. There's a light. I better get ready. Ow. It's very hard to hit them when they move like that. Oh, it's the leak. No. Ooh. Ooh. No. Ooh. What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, got you. Look at my health. I so nearly died there. Holy crap. Wow. Oh, that was so close. I couldn't hit them. One melee guy and a range guy at the same time. The melee guys just do insane damage. Don't ever let them hit you. The range guys don't do that much damage when they do hit you. But they shoot like hell, so. And they're also really weak. Right, I got another red stim. Red stims are basically just uh, really powerful healing. So use them wisely. Oh, look, that's the other one that comes down here. So it's just one room down here. That's a shame. So we got some vases and something to loot over here. Can I loot this? What is that? No, I don't know what that is. I don't really care. All right. Nothing in this cabinet. A very strange room. Oh, I can hear it. This is probably a cave on my left. Well, there you go. That's your dungeon uh, video right there. That's the clear of the dungeon. God, we got like 2,000 pixels from that. We didn't really get many like loot or anything, but we did get a lot of money, which is very useful. Thanks very much for watching, guys. Do let me know if you enjoy the Starbound content so I can continue doing it. And I'll see you guys next time.